Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm kind of on a roll here because I want to do um, some of my favorite spring and summer products. And the next product I'm going to be sharing with you guys are some of my favorite long-lasting um, eyeliners, both pencil and liquid. And I don't know about you guys, but my skin, it's a combination um, and oily. So my eyelids, they tend to get a lot more oilier than the average person's eyelids. But of course, if you're a combination oily, then you understand what I'm saying. Um, so I have to use primer um, on my um, lash line even and underneath my eyes so when I put on my eyeliner it doesn't like smudge so I'm always on the lookout for some really good lasting um, eyeliners so let me get started with a couple of great um, pencil forms from the drugstore and I have to tell you guys I've had fun kind of exploring some new eyeliners from the drugstore um, and the first two colors that I have are from NYX and these are the slide on eye pencils and I guess these are supposed to be comparative to um, Urban Decay's 24-7 and I have the purple, so I have purple there very nice and then I have the jet black which I am a big black eyeliner girl so I have a ton of um, black eyeliners but those are the two swatches there and then um, what I like about them is if you just let it sit for a little bit when you rub it I mean I don't ever try to like do this to my eye and rub it back and forth so the fact that there's still some there after putting a lot of pressure and mixing it with my oils um, to me that's really good another great new one that I've just recently discovered are the Scandalize from Rimmel and these are also some great jumbo pencils so I've been using these on my waterline and let me guys just show you these are waterproof so look how creamy that is and um, I really have been enjoying this I actually want to get some more okay, colors. Okay so that's the, the drugstore my two favorite high-end um, black liners that I use are the Urban Decay 24-7 Perversion now I have Perversion and then I have Zero I love the Perversion better because it's more matte and it's more intense and when you just glide it on watch this it's like very I'm hardly using any pressure like I was very light with that to so the top line here that's the perversion and this is the scandalize and then my other one this one is a PowerPoint pencil from Mac as you can see it's one of my favorites it's called engraved and this one is really great for the waterline too I lost the top to it so I'm kind of sad because it's kind of drying out so I'm hoping I can find a replacement for it but that's the Mac um, engraved on top so as you can see this one's probably the most um, blackest but this is the creamiest one and this one was really black creamy as well so you've got a lot of good ones there so these are my, so my favorite liquid ones that I um, have really been enjoying a lot this spring and now probable for the summer for their long lasting effects um, is the L'Oreal um, the super slim infallible this is supposed to be 12 hours, and um, this is a really super small pen. I don't know if you guys can see that. I really like this because what I like to do is I like to press it on the side like that and get a super thick line, or I like to kind of draw it over. So let me kind of just show you. I have some on already, but I'm just going to go over what I have. So what I like to do is take it to the lash line, and I really press against the lash line like this. And I take the pointed part and I dot along the lash line and I take the point and I make a winged out and then I connect it and I go like this for a, a much more like defined winged look. So that's what Super I do. Slim. And I have found this one to be pretty long lasting as well. So that's my drugstore. Um, my other drugstore brand I really love is the Physician's Formula Eye Booster. It's actually two in one. It's supposed to um, boost your eyeliner, um, your eyelash. I can't talk today, sorry. Um, because it has like a serum in it. And I really like it. You can shake it and you can hear it. And it also has a small pen pencil to it. And as you can see again, if you just go on the side like that and then you draw a line, you can make it as thick or as long as you like. So what I do again, it's always key for me with a liquid pen, um, a liquid um, eyeliner, is you really want to get it close to the lash line, right? Get it really close and kind of use a point and go to the lash line. And then again, if you want to wing it out, make a line 
like that, and then connect it down. And this one to me, I have to tell you, this is pretty good stuff. I was actually rediscovered this. So I actually had this in my makeup bag at work, and I was just playing around with it, and I had put it on my hand. And I realized when I got home, and I had washed my hand several times, it was still there on my hand. I'm like, oh my gosh, I have forgotten about how good this one was. So um, I rediscovered this, and I got a new one. So I really like that. This one is called Ultra Black. So um, the last one I have is a Sephora, and it's a navy blue, and I love wearing navy blue liners um, in the summer, but this is my favorite uh, liquid one. And again, you shake it, and the product is in here, but this one's more of a felt tip, and it's really pointed as well. And I'll show you guys. So again, you kind of take it, and you draw a small line, or you can go on the side, and you can draw a thicker line. So this is really good. So let me kind of show you guys. I'm going to go back up top now and smudge. This top one is the MAC one, right? So see that? And then all the way across, all of them. The engraved one is the, is the most uh, um, This one left, is the so. L'Oreal one. When you move your finger, you kind of have some movement on it. And then if you do the Physician's Formula, there's no movement whatsoever. So Sephora, again, it doesn't budge anywhere. So these are my favorite eyeliners for the spring and summer, guys. If you're looking for some long-lasting products, go check these out. Um, for the cost, you can really find some really affordable um, eyeliner products. Um, I switch out a lot, so I mean, I know these are a lot. But the thing is, is that I'm always on the lookout for a long-lasting black liner. That's why I do have a lot, because I really like to find the best one. So, anyway, thank you for letting me share these with you guys. I hope you have a good day, good night, or whenever you watch this, and I'll see you next time. Bye!